Willkommen zurück bei Game of Thrones. Ja, in der letzten Folge haben wir als Ethan Forrester, Lord von Stronghold Forrester, entschieden, dass wir den Bastard Snow äh, als einen Lord empfangen werden, damit wir auch äh, auf diplomatischen Wege äh, Frieden bekommen werden. Aber nun geht es erstmal wieder zurück nach King's Landing zu Mira. Lady Marjorie's Chambers, Red Keep, King's Landing. Hm. Nehmen wir mal den Schlüssel. Sollten wir ihn nehmen oder nicht nehmen? Ich meine, wir sind schließlich in äh, Lady Marjorie's Zimmer. Ach komm, wir nehmen ihn mit. Was ist das da hinten? Ach, das Siegel. Ne, das lassen wir schön da. Marjorie? Oh. Lady Marjorie is still with the king. I thought you'd want to know. Thank you. Mira, look. The other day when you asked Lady Marjorie for help, I only spoke out of fear for her. I want to help you if there's anything I can do. Your poor family. I can't imagine how you must feel. You're sweet to offer, Sarah. Thank you. Lady Marjorie is always saying how important friends and allies are in King's Landing. Just know, I will be here for you if you ever... My lady, I'll leave you to talk. Are you all right, my lady? The king was not inclined to offer help for your family. I'll need this mended. Gods. He said I was too easily swayed. And he reminded me that I am not yet his wife. I allayed his fear. For now. But it will be a long time before I can ask him for anything again. Nothing I said could cheer him. I'm so sorry, my lady. I should never have asked you for the King's help. Understand, it was my mother's plan, not mine. I just hope you can find some way to forgive me. This is simply not how things are done, Mira. Not in King's Landing. I'm sorry, my lady. <sighs> Soon I will be queen, and maybe then I'll be in a better position to help you. But for now, now, we must both be cautious. I must send a raven. I have to warn my family. If you'll excuse me, my lady. Ja, das lief ja nicht so gut. My lady. Begging your pardon, my lady. I hope I didn't frighten you. I'm glad to see you. Thank you, my lady. I hope you saw. I was right before about Lady Marjorie and Queen Cersei. I just want you to know I, I can help you if you'd like, and your family if you're willing to trust me. I hear all sorts of things, things that could be useful for you. How can you help me? My problems can't be solved by what you might overhear. Which is why you must trust me, milady. You need allies. Hopefully I've proven I could be useful to you. I'm sorry. I... I really must go. Please don't despair. I know people who... People who'd be willing to help you.
interessant. Sehr interessant. Where's Sir Roiland? He should be here. The man values pride more than honor. We'll do without him. And without King's Landing. I know you'd hoped Mira could help us, but I'm confident we've enough strength of our own. Your men stand ready to act if needed. I hope so. You made the right decision, my lord. Isn't this a lovely pile of timber? Not the place I'd want to be if there was a fire. Ironwood is near impervious to flame, my lord. Is it? May I introduce Lord Ramsay of House Bolton? Son of Roose Bolton. Although a bastard, Lord Ramsay has the full authority of Thank the you, Warden Lord. of the... That's enough. Who is this little boy? Is he lost? Lord Ramsay, welcome to Ironrath. Aren't you the little lord? Lord Whitehall told me you were young, but this... Look at you. A token for the new Warden of the North. Let me guess. Forrester Iron. Carved by our most skilled craftsmen. Ironwood. Doesn't look like much. What do you think? <laughs> Not bad. Lord Whitehill, can your lot do this? Given enough time, we could learn... Given enough time, you could do a great many things. But not this, apparently. Look at that. War Forester. Lord Ramsay? Come out where I can see you. We really must focus on the business at hand. Lord Ramsay, I understand you've come here for assurance of our fealty. Fuck fealty. We came here for justice. We'll get to your justice. First, let's see you bend the knee to my father. Lord Bolton, Warden of the North. Words are wind. Anyone can say they're loyal. My Lord. Ha! That wasn't so hard now, was it? Here's the thing. I don't care about your loyalty. The Crown, however, wants what you've got. Whatever you've been supplying the Starks for centuries, Ships, shields, chamber pots. I expect you'll do the same for us. My father has promised as much to the king. You wouldn't want to make him a liar, would you? That wouldn't reflect well on me. We will double our efforts for your father, my lord. That's a good little lord. You can't trust a forester. They murdered our men. It was a forest squire who did it. One Whitehill soldier dead. One Bolt. Yet your man lived. No, you're mistaken. That's not how it happened. Our men are dead. How it happened is irrelevant. Then you welcomed me into your hall like a proper lord, hoping I wouldn't linger outside long enough to notice your pathetic little army. That sort of insolence from one of our loyal Bannermen will not do. So I've come up with a solution that will benefit everyone. The White Hills will be taking control of your Ironwood from this day forward. What? What? The Ironwood? But... That is our livelihood. Then you'd better well find another fucking job. You can't do that. <laughs> Why not? You know something the White Hills don't? We are talking about trees. You grow them, 
You cut them down. We have loyal craftsmen who make the finest weapons. The White Tellers have no such craftsmen. Do you want Ironwood for the next five years? Or the next fifty generations? The little lord does have a point. We'll try this. Lord Whitehill will take half of your iron wood, and we'll see who fares better. But my lord... Half of something is better than the nothing you had before. To ensure there's no trouble, Lord Whitehill will install a garrison of 20 men within your walls. At Ironrath, that we cannot abide. Ethan... They'll help maintain the King's peace. And make sure there's no more trouble. White Hill men? Never. It's already done. You have a man you trust? My son, Griff. Griff will lead the garrison. You have no right. White Hills have no place here. Lads, do make this. Please, Duncan, don't. Look at this, little forester. You're not frightened, are you? Lord Ramsay, please. And you? Are you Lord Ethan's older sister? I'm his twin, my lord. Ah, twins. Well, like the Queen and her brother. Well, <laughs> hopefully not just like the Queen and her brother. <laughs> I never had a sister. Always wanted one. We have more to discuss, Lord Snow. I have an idea. You'll come with me. You can be my highborn ward. Lord <gasps> Ramsay, that's enough. Do you like hunting? Let her go. She's quite pretty, your sister. I suppose you can stay. Aren't you the bold lord? Oh, <laughs> no! What have you done? But no. I don't want a bold lord. <laughs> Far too much trouble. Ethan! Ethan! No! 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 Even though you did bend the knee. I think we've come to an understanding. Lord Ethan! I certainly feel better about all this. He's what have you done? However, the foresters need to keep their end of the bargain. Take the boy of your wolf. No! Kill him. If they give you any trouble. Brian! Lovely meeting all of you. We'll have to do it again sometime. Somebody help him! Fetch the mace so quickly! You brought this on yourself. Mama! Please, stop! Don't let him go! Let him go! Oh, let it go. Stop the help help me, Ryan! Please, let me go! Let me go, Ryan! Do something! Ethan? Oh, my son. Oh. My. God. Does your story has begun next time on Game of Thrones? Ethan sacrificed himself for us all. He saved Talia's life. He'll be remembered as Ethan the Brave. This house needs a leader. Lord Ethan named me Sentinel. I will lead this house. My sister asked you to swear loyalty to her son, and you flat out refused. We can't let them hurt Ryan too. We have to stop them. We do not stand alone. There are those who will fight for us. Those who hold House Forrester above all other loyalties. Those who will not stop until Ethan is avenged. Until Ryan is home again, our house will not fall. We will be ready. Nothing comes without a cost, my lady. Are you prepared for what might happen?
Ja, das war harter Tobak. Ich meine, man ist es ja gewohnt, bei Game of Thrones ist niemand sicher vor dem Tod, aber damit hätte ich jetzt nicht gerechnet. Wer weiß, wenn ich mich anders entschieden hätte, ob das vielleicht anders gekommen wäre. Das werden wir erstmal nicht herausfinden. Wahrscheinlich, wenn ich dieses Let's Play komplett durch habe, werde ich es bestimmt sicherlich noch ein oder zweimal nochmal spielen. Ich finde allgemein Telltale Games super. Jetzt schauen wir mal, wie die Community entschieden hat, sofern die Community den schon gespielt hat. Ja, äh, wir und 47,6% der Spieler haben zu Bone gestanden. Dann wir und nur 26,8% haben äh, Lady Marjorie die Treue geschworen. Ja, und äh, wir und 40,4% Freed Eric. Ich muss gerade sagen, ich bin ein bisschen überfordert, was Freed heißt, also da könnt ihr mir gerne helfen. Ja, wir und 61,1% haben uns für Danken als Sentinel entschieden und genauso haben auch wir und 63,1% entschieden, Ramsey in der großen Halle zu empfangen. Und äh, ja, das war's mit Episode 1. Ich bin gespannt, äh, wann Episode 2 rauskommt. Ich hoffe, das wird so schnell wie möglich der Fall sein. Dann werden wir uns auf jeden Fall wiedersehen. Dann heißt es auch wieder... Game of Thrones.